welcome to Tahiti. I have just come back from, I think, one of the coolest tours I have ever, ever done. Uh, today we are in Tahiti, which is part of French Polynesia, a place in the South Pacific that I've never been to before. Um, and our tour today was a lagoon discovery tour, it's a snorkeling tour. So we boarded this, this little tiny catamaran, me and about 17 guests, and we went on a little cruise around um, part of the island of Tahiti. Now, Tahiti itself um, is surrounded by loads of coral reefs, and these coral reefs sort of act as barriers from the sea hitting the, the main shoreline of Tahiti. So that's where these lagoons come from, because the sea hits the, the coral reef, which creates a sort of little mini lagoon in the sea, and then you have the shoreline. So our adventure today, our tour today, took us to two of these little lagoons. One of them was right outside the airport, which sounds kind of maybe a little bit dull, but believe me, it wasn't because there was a plane wreck. There was an underwater plane wreck. It was unbelievable to see something like that. You've seen it in pictures, you see it in videos, you see it in movies, but to physically see something real, it was just so surreal to see. The aquatic life, the fish, the fish are huge here. They are massive and they are not afraid of you. They, they come so close to you. I was, I was snorkeling and I could literally reach out and touch this giant tiger fish that came up to me. It was, it was unbelievable. But the coolest part of this tour is that we had an escort. We had a, uh, like a jet ski escort with us. End of the day, it's a snorkeling tour. If someone gets into trouble, they need to be rescued fairly quickly. So we had like a jet ski, again, a jet ski who came along and made sure everyone was okay. And everybody was okay, which is good. But then the tour concluded. And the guy on the jet ski said, hey, you're the, you're the escort, right? Do you want to come back to shore with me on the jet ski? And I'm like, heck yeah, I do. That's so cool. And we went <laughs> back to the shore on this jet ski. And I've never done a jet ski before. It was awesome. It was brilliant. We hit these huge waves. We went fast. The guy, we went, went all the way to the dock and then realized that the boat was nowhere near us. So we went back, did some sort of cool sort of uh, maneuvers in the ocean. Um, we found a restaurant, he showed me a good restaurant to eat tonight because tonight in Tahiti, we don't leave until 2 a.m. It's currently four o'clock now, I've got to go back to work in a minute, but then I finish at seven, we don't leave till two, I can go back out again. So I'm gonna go and have a roe fish, uh, it, was a, it, was a, it was a dish he recommended to me, roe fish with coconut milk. That's quite a Tahitian thing to eat. And that's what I'm going to do tonight. So it's been an earth, it's been an awesome tour, an absolutely freaking awesome tour. On this tour, we had this wonderful tour guide. I think his name was Apia or Apawa or something like that. And he he's from uh, the, the island next door called Morea, a place where we're going tomorrow. And this guy was incredible. He was so friendly, so warm, so nice. He was so knowledgeable. He knew everything. He's a local guy, I remember, so he knows everything. Um, he gave us fresh pineapple, he gave us, um, like, a, like he brought his own ukulele, he gave us a song on the, on the, on the catamaran. He gave us a hacker, because again, it's, it's a Polynesian culture here, it's, it's, it's French, but it's also Polynesian, so you have the whole hacker culture here as well. Um, everyone here has got such a, a strong national identity, everyone's very, very proud of their Polynesian heritage and their French heritage as well. Um, and it shows, everyone is so happy, so warm. They're not sort of, oh, here's more tourists, here we go again. They want the tourism. They're such welcoming people here. And uh, it's so nice. It's so nice, so refreshing. Tahiti itself is incredible. It's so scenic, it's so green. It's incredibly mountainous, which I didn't expect that. I thought it would be, you know, it's a South Pacific island. I thought maybe you might have like a mountain where the volcano once was and that would be it. But no, there's mountains everywhere and they're all spiky. It's it, it's phenomenal. The, the the scenery, the landscape is is beautiful here. If you ever get the chance to come to Tahiti, just come here. It is stunning. Tomorrow, we are in Morea. We can literally see Morea right now from where we are. It takes 30 minutes in a ferry to get from Tahiti to Morea. So it has been an amazing day so far and it's only four o'clock. So I'm gonna go and do my afternoon shift and then I'll see you all tonight when I check out the actual capital city of Papiti. Sunshine 
pray You never know, dear How much I love you Please don't take my sunshine away second lagoon of our lagoon discovery tour and this lagoon is much much shallower i'm literally now i'm stood on my knees it's that shallow and i'm still way above the waterline so it's really really shallow um the water the water is so nice here it's so clear i don't even need to go snorkeling to see the fish it's it's beautiful and it's so warm i've never been in an ocean where it's this warm. It's like being in a bathtub. It's not like when you go into the Caribbean Sea and it's initially a little bit cold and then you adjust to the temperature. It's just perfectly right the second you step into the water. So this is probably the best place on earth for snorkeling, I'll be honest. This is absolutely amazing. You have to come to Tahiti.